if nothing else on this question, I am consistent. I have always been pro-choice. I have never been endorsed by West Virginians for life. And I think I have my reasons for that. Uh, the Episcopal Church uh, believes that it is an individual choice for a woman to make that choice. They do not necessarily feel that a man who never has the opportunity to be pregnant can uh, make that decision for them. Uh, when I say that, I figured when I got the invitation to this, that, that would probably be a question. And it may take more than 60 seconds, I think. Uh, I don't believe that abortion is correct. I don't believe that abortion is what should be done. I did not uh, vote for the right, uh, the constitutional over, override of that because at the time it was considered unconstitutional. We also heard that in West Virginia there were seven late term uh, abortions and I think all of them would have led to children that although gifts of God, because we all will agree with that, probably would have had a bigger struggle in life than they uh, would otherwise. That's obviously an independent question for you. Parental notification under 16. In West Virginia, unfortunately, many of those who would be notifying uh, that their child was pregnant may have even caused the pregnancy themselves, I think. And I believe that a judge or a physician is a better judge of that. I realize I'm in opposition with you all on this, but you have my reasons. I have always been that way, so I haven't changed, and I appreciate the opportunity to come and present that to you. Thank you. Thank you so much.